Hey, this is your friend, the Gospel Elder A.T. Robinson, back with another video. And today, real quickly, I just want to wish everyone a big thank you for all those who celebrated my special day on today. Um, if you could wait to the end of this uh, uh, this re recording, I have something very important to say. Uh, but again, thank you for all the donated and gave uh, love gifts, birthday gifts. All those will be going towards back into the ministry to help push forward the ministry of Jesus Christ so that we can minister and help people be their best through Jesus Christ and also just be better human beings so we can help change the world. So I greatly appreciate that. Very special thank you to everyone, my wife Shalana, my mother uh, and my mother-in-law, uh, my parents, my dad, uh, Apostle Porter, uh, Valerie, uh, uh, Priscilla Bailey, uh, let me see, Wendell Jenkins, uh james todd and the list goes on and on i'm trying not to forget anybody my sister valerie and who else those are people who actually donated and so they're going to help push the ministry and i greatly appreciate it and there's some other ones if i forgot please forgive me and if you decide to give this 365 atr that's the cash app but here's the thing i realized something about birthdays everybody thinks that their birthday is special people it revolves around them. People help celebrate them and it's your special day. But the truth of the matter is once that day passed, they move on to the next birthday. As a matter of fact, when this day is up, my dad's birthday is right after mine. So quickly the celebration and attention moves towards him. And what that brought to my attention after living on this earth for 43 years, I started to understand that we celebrate our birthdays and we want people to shower us with affection and love. But then ultimately that phase, if you look at it from that perspective. So what I decided to do and what hit me this morning as I was going through my day is that I don't really want to look at it that way anymore. If I never get another gift, if I never get anything, as I said before, everything that I received monetarily wise was going towards ministry anyway. But if I never receive anything, if I never receive a card, I would still be appreciated. And the reason why is because I started to look out instead of in. I started to look that over these last this last year and in these last 42, 43 years of my life, there have been people who have been instrumental in my life in making it better. And I really have to say, oh, tell God, thank you. Even if they were not able to give to me, but yet I was able to minister to them. I have to tell God, thank you, because those people, even in the fact that I was able to minister to them, uh, made it so that I was able to fulfill my purpose and my destiny and be able to get closer to God by doing what he has called me to do. So yes, people always say I'm deep. People say I de think differently. And this is one of those situations where I think going forward, I'm just going to have to look at this thing dif differently. I don't care about the accolades and all that. That's good. But the next day we're on to the next person and wishing them happy birthday. Trust me. And about an hour and a half or so, I'm going to post something. And some of the many people who have posted and celebrated me will start celebrating my father. What I'm doing right now is making sure that I celebrate you guys all the time. And there's people who have been in my life who've made it so much more interesting. My co-workers and different friends that I have in my life and people who um, I mentor and who I, I am. Um, I have mentors uh, as well. And so. These are things that we have to kind of look at that the, it's not about us. And I have to start looking at around me and telling people. And that's what I did today uh, to as I saw people and connected with them. And I'm going to continue to thank them as I come in contact with them again, just for the impact and what they've done to my life. And I greatly appreciate it. So above all things on this day, on my birthday, we, we you know, you say happy birthday to me. But I just really want to say a thank you to everyone who supported me. For those who have joined my page, it's still, as of today, it's only 30 days old. And it's still like 1,300, 1,400 people who've joined and just connected. And they didn't have to. But even that is uh, blesses my heart so that I can continue to, to preach the word of God, not just on Sundays, but throughout the week, whether it's locally, but also virtually. So I just want to tell you guys, thank you, that I really appreciate you. And I hope you have a wonderful day. And on your birthday, yes, I'm going to celebrate you. Yes, I'm going to appreciate you on your birthday. But even on your birthday, begin to look out from among yourself and celebrate others. I love you. God bless you. And thank you again for all the well wishes. Bye-bye.